What up guys, it's your boy Tiger Bane and we are back to continue our journey through Kanto. I hope you're as excited as I am. I've been waiting forever to jump back into this game. I'm so hyped up about this. Let, I'm not going to keep you guys waiting too much longer. We're going to jump right into it. We're picking our starter. You guys did an amazing, amazing job voting. We have a few different options. Uh, yes, control works. So, Swine Up was super popular. But I think a lot of people realize that he doesn't evolve into Mammoth Swine in this game. Swine Up did not make the cut. Next! We had the almighty dunce bars. And my god, everyone was voting for dunce bars. We had a, well not everyone, we had a few people voting for dunce bars. And it gained a little more, uh, a little, a little, a few more votes than I anticipated. But, dunce bars. Don't get it either. The one who got it was your boy, Waylord. So Tiger, you want to go with the water Pokemon Waylord? Yes. Yes, I do. This Pokemon is really quite energetic. Really? Do you want to give a nickname to this Waylord? Nuzlocke rules, we have to give a nickname to the Waylord. Now, I thought long and hard about what I wanted to nickname the Waylord. A few different options. Uh, many of them adult options. But it's a PG channel. It's a PG channel, guys. Keep those adult thoughts to yourself. Uh, <laughs> what I decided to do was, since this is my very first Pokemon playthrough, uh, and I've wanted to do this for absolutely ever, um, I decided to name it after the person who who actually uh, got me into YouTube. The person who uh, inspired me to jump on and start making videos for you guys and, all, and doing all that stuff. Um, and that person is my guy, PewDiePie. No, I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. Uh, that person is my guy, Indie Mouse. Uh, if you guys haven't already checked out his videos, you should definitely go do so. He is ridiculously better than I am at this stuff. Um, so if you enjoy me, you'll enjoy him. Uh, Indie, does it fit? Oh, it fits. Indie Mouse! I hope I spelled that right. Who loses his mind if I didn't? And there we go, people. Great, I'll take this one then. Oh, I should have called him Indie Mouse. That would have been great. That would have been amazing. Alrighty, there we go. Let's let's check out. Let's check him out. It's a, it's a boy. Well, that's a good thing. Lonely nature. Oh, look. He's massive, dude. Alright. Uh, attack 15. That's not bad. Special attack is 14. His defense is a lot lower than I thought it would. Well, I mean, I guess for level 5, it's it's pretty high. Oblivious prevents attraction. Well. Well. Uh, splash, Growl, Water Gun, and Roll Out. That is a great move set to start off with. That is amazing. Alright. So we're going to rock out with Indie Mouse now. He's going to be dope. Alright. Oh, I should have saved. No, I should have saved. Green, wait, Tiger, let's check out a Pokemon. Come on, I'll take you on. Oh, you wait. Who did he take? Did he take Dunsparce? Dude, hey, Dunsparce got left in the middle, didn't it? He took Swine up. Oh, poor Dunsparce. Oh, for Pete's sake, so pushy as always. Tiger, you've never had a Pokemon battle before. Yes, I have, you liar. You liar. I've battled for many, many years. Pokemon battles when trainers pit their Pokemon against each other. The trainer that makes the other trainer's Pokemon faint by lowering their HP to zero wins. Pretty self-explanatory. But rather than talking about it, you'll learn more from experience. Try battling and see for yourself. Alright. Let's hit him with that water gun. Oh, he's only ice type Pokemon, isn't he? He's only never mind. Inflicting damage on the foe is the key to any battle! It's super effective! Oh, he must be ice ground already then. Alrighty, well look at that, that was easy! That was easy! Hmm. 
Hmm, excellent. If you win and earn prize money and your Pokemon... If you win, you earn prize money and your Pokemon will grow. I don't know why that was so hard for me to read. Battle other trainers that make your Pokemon strong. Okay, I'll make my Pokemon battle to toughen it up. Tiger, Gramps, smell you later! He's just rude, isn't he? He's just rude, isn't he? Poor Dunsparce. Just left here. Guys, you ready to see what Pokemon we're going to encounter? So remember, the Nuzlocke hasn't actually started until we get the Pokeballs. Alright, so we're going to head straight to Route 1. Oh my gosh, you walk so slow. You guys ready? Let's see what we get. This, okay, so the first Pokemon I run into now, I don't have to catch because, I, like I said, I don't have Pokeballs, so that doesn't matter. So, what is it? What is it? What could we potentially get? Oh, a Noctowl. That's cool. Um, we are 100% going to be taking out all of these because if we die, it doesn't matter. Uh, it doesn't matter yet. So, I am going to take on every wild Pokemon that I encounter to get as much experience as possible. Because once the Nuzlocke starts, that's when the fun begins. That's when the fun begins. Any Mouse grew to level 7. Look at you, Any Mouse. Look at you. A pseudo -wudo. Ooh, pseudo -wudo would be good on the team. Indie Mouse would cover for his weaknesses. Is that just wrecking everything on this route? Dun 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 dun. Alright, so we have to go up here to Pallet Town and pick up Professor Oak's parcel. Oh, Viridian City. Pallet Town? Why did I say Pallet Town? It's Viridian City! Uh, was it the Pokemon? I'm pretty sure it's the Pokemon. Hey, you came from Pallet Town. Yes, I did. You know Professor Oak, right? His order came in. Can I get you to take it to him? Oak's parcel. See, there you go. Alright, let's get out of Let's get back out of here. Let's head straight down to Pallet Town. Give Oak his parcel. And let's catch us some Pokemon. Oh, man, you need to run faster. We're gonna run through all the grass as well, just to see if there's anything else cool that we can catch. Because so far we saw Knockout and Sudowoodo. I can't remember if there's a third rare encounter. Oh, I ran away! Why'd I run away? Oh, I... I can't remember. Yeah, I can't remember for the life of me if there's a third encounter, if there's a third Pokemon in this area. Because the way I um. Just so you guys know, the way I randomized it was one for one. So if there's uh, usually on Route One, you can only you, you encounter Pidgeys and Raditas. I think that's it. I think that's it. Those are the only two you encounter. What I've done is I've randomized it so a random Pokemon takes up one of those slots. So instead of Pidgeys, we get Pseudowoodos. Instead of Raditas, we get uh, Noctowl. Oh, why are you splash? Why don't you splash? This is not a great start. Oh, okay, there we go. He learned splash. Well, that's great. Well, that's great! Alright, bye, Sudowoodo. See you later, bro. Good night. I'm gonna battle one more Pokemon to get up to level 8, and then we'll be good. We'll be good to go, guys! Yeah, it must only be Sudowoodo as a knockout. Alright, and there we go. Level 8. Level 8! Indie Mouse grew to level 8. Look at you getting them gains, bro! Getting them gains! Jeez, he is ridiculous. Look at his stats. Let's just take a quick oh, suss of his stats. Uh, 20 attack, 
His special attack 19, which isn't that far behind, which is pretty good. His defense worries me. I thought it'd be... I was really excited when everyone was picking uh, Waylord because I figured that he would be a lot, uh, a lot tankier. But that's okay. Well, can you just walk, walk in? What up, Oak? Oh, Tiger, how is my old Pokemon? Well, it seems to be growing more attached to you. You must be talented as a Pokemon trainer. <laughs> Shucks. Oh, you. What's that? You have something for me? Ah, it's the custom Pokeball. I had it. I had it on order. Thank you. Gramps, man, this guy's just such a brat. I almost forgot. What did you call me for? Oh, right. I have a request for you two. On the desk there is my invention, the Pokédex. It automatically records data on the Pokémon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. Say, uh, how I met your mother reference right there. Encyclopedia. Uh, Tiger and Green, take these with you. Woo! We got the Pokédex. Our journey starting. You can't get detailed data on Pokémon by just seeing them. You must catch them to obtain the to obtain the complete data. So here are some tools for catching wild Pokémon. And it starts. All right, the Nuzlocke has officially begun now. So if any of our Pokémon die, it's goodbye to them, which we don't want to see happen. When a wild Pokemon appears, it's fair game. Just throw a Pokeball at it and try to catch it. This won't always work, however. A healthy Pokemon can escape. You have to be lucky to make a complete guide on all the Pokemon in the world. That was my dream, but I'm too old. I can't get the job done, decrepit old man. Uh, so I want you two to fulfill my dream for me. Get moving, you two. This is a great undertaking in Pokemon history. All right, Gramps, leave it all to me. I hate to say it, but you won't be necessary for this, Tiger. I know, I'll borrow a town map for my sis. Good idea, Green. Good idea. Don't bother coming around to my place after this. That's just mean. That's just mean. Thought we were friends, thought we were buddies, next door neighbors and stuff. You know what? Is this Green's house? Yep. No one in there anyway. Grandpa asked you to run an errand. Gee, that's lazy of him here. This will help you. Thanks, Daisy. You're a lot nicer than your mean ass brother. All right, we're gonna save real quick. Yes, over right. Uh, click on save. Cool. Alrighty, guys. The first Pokemon to join our journey. After obviously our legendary starter, Indie Mouse, is Noctowl. I, I'm, not, I'm not mad about that. I ain't mad about Noctowl. I ain't mad about Noctowl at all, but I can't touch Noctowl. I just realized that. Uh, we're just gonna try throwing a Pokeball at it. If I knock it out. No, we're just running with. Nope. Uh nah, it's not gonna get caught, I have to hit it. It's level two, what if I'm gonna take it out? I can't use rollout, because it's rock type, it's weak to rock. Because rollout's rock type and it's weak to rock. I have to use water gun. Let me check out how strong the moves are. 40. 30. That goes for 5 turns. So I can't do anything anyway. So it'll just keep rolling. So I have to use water. Oh, look at that! Look at that! Noctowl wants to be part of the team. He's telling me to catch him. One, two, oh, I'm so excited. I'm gonna run out of Pokeballs. If I run out of Pokeballs, that's it, I'm screwed. I can't, that means I can't catch anything. So if I don't catch the Snowcat, I can't catch anything on the Route 1. One, two, come on, I have one more Pokeball. Noctowl, you want to be a part of this team. Listen, listen, Noctowl. 
right here. Right here. Right here. Knock out. One, two, three. Far out, man. Ah. Oh. There you go, guys. Noctowl is not joining our team yet. Or at all, really. At all. Okay. Okay. Well, that was that. That was that. What should it be, Noctowl? Just to remind me. I'm so mad about that. I need to go buy more Pokeballs now. I waste all five of them on Noctowl. Ooh, been so cool. Having a flying type this early on would have been helpful too. Look at Indie Mouse, level 9 already. Back in Viridian City, we're gonna heal up real quick. And then we're gonna hit the mart and we're gonna buy some Pokeballs. Uh, the other thing I, I quickly realized is with uh, with Waylord, my first gym. Oh no, it's not. I was gonna say the first gym would be super easy because Brock's got all rock types. But I've just realized that he may not be super easy because he probably won't have all rock types. Alright, how many Pokeballs? We're gonna... We're gonna go with 10 Pokeballs for now. And we're gonna grab... Uh, two potions. We're gonna grab two potions. Uh, we can't venture out, can we? Can we? No, we can't. Oh wait, no, Viridian City. We can. We've got. We've got a few more options to catch some Pokemon. We got. We got. Uh, down here. Route 22, which we can try and catch something. Our Route 22 encounter is. Spoink! I love Spoink! Spoink is dope! I'm really scared I'm gonna hit him. I'm really scared I'm gonna hit him. I'm pretty sure Spoink is pretty buff though. I'm six levels above it. And it's only a Spoink. It's not a Grump pick yet. Do I take that risk? Let's try throwing a Pokeball first. See, I don't want to run out of Pokeballs. Because I've still got... I've still got like three encounters. To, no, two, two more encounters to go. I don't know. Uh, maybe I should have left this for a little bit. One, two, three! Yes! Welcome to the team, Boink! Alrighty. Boink is joining our team. What are we gonna call him? Give a nickname to Spoink. Yes, I'd like to give a nickname to Spoink. Uh. Uh. Give me a second. And I will be back with a nickname for our boy Spoink. And we're back! Alrighty, guys, so. I thought long and hard about what to name uh, this fabulous, fabulous Spoink. And, um. I've actually been playing Kingdom Hearts again recently. It's one of my favorite games of all time. And it got me into that Disney vibe. And we looked at Pumba. So Pumba, and I was like, you know what? You know what? Pumba is the way to go. Uh, where are you? P-U, I think I'm just gonna leave this right. P-U-M-B-A, Pumba. Alrighty, so we have Pumba and Indie Mouse. Let's check out Pumba's stats. Let's check out his stats real quick. Pumba, what do you got going for me? What do you got going for me, man? Alright, so 
psychic type, mild nature. Oh, special defense, blowing up, own tempo for red confusion. That's actually not bad. Between uh, Indie Mouse, who doesn't get attracted, who, who doesn't get, he prevents attraction. Sorry, bruh. Uh, and Pumba, who prevents confusion. That's not, that's not bad at all. Uh, special defense is off the charts, uh, and a special attack is speed are good as well. Uh, and all he has is splash. Wow. Okay. Well, we we are going to switch Pumba out the front for a sec because we have a battle. We have a battle to take on. Hey, Tiger, you're off to the Pokemon League. Forget about it. You probably don't have any badges, do you? The guy won't let you through without them. By the way, did your Pokemon get any stronger? Let's find out. Let's find out, bruh. Alright, he's got a Lydian. Level 9 as well. Ooh. Ooh. Alright, well, we're gonna quickly back out. Go straight to Indie Mouse. I don't think he'll have. Unless he's got something like Grass Knot, which I don't think Gladian can get at level 9. Then we should be good to go. And we're gonna go with rollout. Oh no. Oh no. Indie Mouse. He uses rollout. Ooh. So hey, he stepped out of confusion! That's my guy! Boy, Pumba grew to level four and level five. Look at us training Pumba away. We we are going to switch out to Pumba again. We just need to get him some experience. We need to get him that that second move, uh, just so that we can actually start using him in battle. That swine up. That swine is going to be terrible. And water gun away. There we go. O code. He O code him. Come grade to level six. Did he learn anything? No. And Indy Mouse up to level ten. Yo, I, I've been loving Indy Mouse, man. He is going off. He is going off. I heard the Pokemon League is crawling with tough trainers. I have to figure out how to get past them. You should quit dawdling and get a move on. What do you think I was doing? What do you think I was doing? Alright, let's move all the way back up to the... Oh god, I really wish I had the running shoes. I can speed up, actually. I could do that. But I won't, because I don't know what it'll sound like. So we're going to heal real quick. Thank you, Nurse Joy. We're going to save real quick. And what we're going to do, uh, before we finish off this episode, I don't know how long this episode is going to be. Not too long. Before I don't want to make these episodes too long. Um, what I'm going to do before we finish it off is we're going to go through this phenomenal creature. He's going to teach us how to uh, catch a Pokemon. And then we will go for one, maybe two more encounters. Because there should be an encounter up here. And then there should be an encounter um, in Viridian Forest. Yeah, that's right. Okay, let's do that. Let's do that. Well now, I've had my coffee and that's what I need to get going. Hmm, what is that red box you have? Ah, so you're working on your Pokédex. Then let me give you a word of advice. Whenever you catch a Pokémon, the Pokédex automatically updates its data. You don't know how to catch a Pokémon? I've caught one already. I suppose I'd better show you then. You don't need to. This should be randomized. It's not. Wow. Ah, that's interesting. It's been randomized, but that's okay. Oh, he's only got one Pokeball. One Pokeball. Alright, 
to old man. Old man Herbert here is going to uh, catch his wheel. There now, tell me that was not educational. It wasn't. And here, take this too. Teachy T. Oh, I remember. The, I remember the Teachy TV. It will teach you about the basics of being a Pokemon trainer. Out of my way, old man. Out of my way. Right, that's just the gym. We can't get through there. Yeah, we can actually. We're gonna go round round two. All right, so we can get an encounter on route two, I believe. Yes, we can. All right, how many Pokeballs do I have? Eight. That should be sufficient. I'm gonna move Spoink back. And our route eight, in, uh, route two, route two encounter is on Lydian. Okay, so that's where he got it from. That's where he got it from. Alright, we're just gonna water gun this guy. Water gun him into oblivion, but not like completely. Uh, it should be enough to catch. In theory. One. Two. Nope. Don't do this, man. Don't do this. Come on, just... Just be cool. Join the team. This is the A team. We got Indie Mouse. We got Pumba. You could be Jiminy, or we'll call you Buzz. You guys will learn pretty quick. I'm not very good with names. Sorry. Two, three. Welcome to the team. Welcome to the team. Yes. All right, our team is growing, guys. Ledian. Yes, I will give a nickname to Ledian. Uh, what are we gonna call you? What are we gonna call you? What are we going to call you? Ledian, you will be called... I know. Because he's a fighting bug. He's a fighting bug. Is he fighting bug? I mean, he definitely punches. We'll call him Cell. We're gonna call him Cell. Alright. What we're gonna do... Should we add him into the team now, or should we see what we have in the forest? He's bug flying. But he punches and stuff, and... I do like him. Alright, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go catch our Viridian Forest Encounter. What else could we have got in here? Are you kidding me?! had an ante and we got a Ledian. Oh, I'm so mad. Alright, get him out of my face. Ah, uh, look, a Pokeball to probably wouldn't have caught him anyway. I, would, I couldn't have hit him. Because everything would have killed him. So it's fine. It's fine. Whatever. Whatever. Just be sour. Could have had an ante. Can you imagine having that beast on the team? Between ante and Indie Mouse? Oh, man. Oh, dude. We would have gone off. Alright. Viridian Forest Encounter. Where are we going to go for it? Let's go over here. Let's go over here. Let's go to this little patch. No, 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 no. Let's go. Let's go. I'm going to have to walk this whole way back. So let's just go over here. The very last patch of grass. That's good. That <gasps> It's a Lugia! Oh, I'm never gonna catch this! I'm never catching this. Alright. Let's use Water Gun. I don't think Water Gun will kill it. No! This game, this game is killing me. First they show me that ante, now they show me a Lugia. Oh man, what is going on? All right, I'm gonna say, that's so much heartbreak. 
There's so much heartbreak. What else could I have caught? What? No, I, I don't want to know. I don't, we'll find out soon enough. We'll find out soon enough. Alrighty, guys. I'm still debating whether or not to throw Ledian onto the team. Whether to throw Cell, sorry, on the team. Um, we'll take a look. We might do. I'll, you guys will find out in the next episode. Um, have, having him probably won't hurt. It'll probably be a good thing. But, with that, I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. Thank you so much for joining me. Shout out to all of you guys for voting for Waylord because he is ridiculous. Um, shout out to Indy Mouse. Go check out his videos. Seriously, he's unbelievably good. Um, puts me to shame. <laughs> Seriously, does. Uh, and don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, share the video with your friends, all that sort of fancy jazz. Because we're in Kanto, baby. We are in Kanto. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye! <laughs>